Every good gang has a headquarters. The Sopranos had Bada Bing. Mustafa. So here's how you get one of those for your gang. Base Metal Gangs is the best mod ever made, so check it out. This is a quick Base Metal Gangs video on how to obtain a headquarter and then make it cute. If you want to learn how to level up the gang itself without cheating, I have an extended gangs video for you. But just to keep this short, I'm going to use that one NPC, Don Lothario, and use a couple of cheats to make him a gang leader. So then I can tell you how to get a gang headquarter. The cheat is right here if you want it. And just like that, you're a gang leader. Your goal is to start a gang and then get it to level 6. You cannot get a headquarter before that. But don't worry, there's a cheat to get you to that gang level 6. All you need is MCCC, and then follow this path to cheat and level up your skill. We're just skipping all the boring stuff and hard work. Then you just type a 6. You also need to hire a right hand man. If you haven't done that already, go ahead and do it with your phone, and then invite him over. Obviously I chose Agnes Crumblebottom. She is gang material. I don't care what anyone says. Go to Manage Worlds, and then pick the lot you want. And in your settings up here, just flip that lot type to be a gang headquarter. Just pick your gang from the drop down. Now, I want my sim to buy that lot. But wait, there's crime. The police are already looking into my operation. I am not scared. I'm having over the right hand granny so that I can get the button to purchase the slot. All you have to do is ask them about a gang headquarter and she'll tell you all the information, which is just the stuff we just did. Here it is in case you forget. And then when you click on her, you'll get the option to buy that headquarter. giving myself some cash. So now here's my super sick ASMR headquarter build. But also comment if you need a video about this granny and NPC Don Lothario running a gang because I think Agnes Crumblebottom is the bee's knees. I like to make mine look like a bar but then have a huge space in the back, you know, for crime. If you go to my most viewed videos, you'll also find some tutorials on how to build a cute little dispensary and sell some fun stuff out of it. I like to make little meeting rooms in the back for special guests and gang members, and then just toss a lock on that door so only gang and gang affiliated sims can access it. Same with your drugs room. You'll need to make sure you include a few things in your headquarters. Put a computer in there for money laundering. Because if you don't launder from your headquarters, you will go to jail, like, all the time. Which you can see in my extended Base Metal Gangs video. Also, I have hired Better Call Paul's Wexler and McGill Law Firm at least five times in the game. And I've gone to jail every single time. I don't know what that's about. Here it is. All done with some blue accents. Looks kind of cute. And now I can run my Agnes Crumblebottom gang.